Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we have a HB P1001. It's a cheap Chinese grade uh, toy grade crawler that had an all or nothing servo. Well, it's not really a servo, it's a motor that just goes all the way around and there's a spring that returns it back. But if you can see just there, I put a Futaba S3003 servo up front, so now I have proportional steering. Um, I'll put a picture up now um, of the ESC that I've put in. Um, I won't be using the receiver in that picture, I'll be using this one. If you can just about see, it's a Turner G TGY. Um, IA6 receiver which should be good for at least a kilometer range because this one is going to be a long distance crawler um, I have in there a one cam split which is this camera and that top split bulb there underneath it is a Maytech FC hub VTX um, which also has a power distribution board on and it's really for a quadcopter but I'm using it because I can switch it up to uh, 500 milliwatts so that should be good for a couple of miles um, I have a TBS Triumph antenna for the video and that's about it really um, I'd have put a 1S in there for the run cam split which is one of these. I split down a 4S into single 1S's. Um, they're 1800 mil, uh, milliamps, so that should run the split for a while. Um, being a split V1, people do have a lot of issues with them. Um, I didn't want to power it up through the Maytech VTX because I don't know, it, it, it just seems when people hook them up to a 5 volt power source. They fry, so I'm running running it from the um, from the lipo battery terminals. Um, I've had it run for two hours non-stop, and it's still working fine. So I'm just going to leave it like that. So there we go. The only other thing I want to do really is stop all this rattle. I need some O-rings put in between these um, link bars just to stuff all that play and I'll probably change the shocks because one of them this one it locks and then it will go down eventually but it's not like these so change the shocks o-rings on the um, link bars and it should be good to go I'm not really bothered about how soft the tyres are because it, it's going to be a long range um, to cover ground more than anything, it's, it's not going to be uh, hardcore lot crawling, it's just for long distance. Um, I have something else which I will put in a different video. All I'm going to say it is it is an axle, axial, axle, axial, however you want to say it, um, and that should be a fun build. Thanks for watching.